Hello, hello, hello. It's your girl Taz on me 77 and I am back with another video. I like to say welcome back to all of my subscribers. To those of you that watch my channel but have not yet subscribed, I appreciate the love as well. But please, if you enjoy this video, go ahead and like, share, and subscribe. So, first of all, I like to say I apologize for my absence, but there's this little thing called pollen that has taken me under. Yes, y'all, I have been so sick the last week with my allergies. It has been pathetic, but your girl is here. My voice is not where it needs to be, but I am feeling better. Thank you to several of you that reached out and gave me well wishes. Your prayers were greatly appreciated. So without further ado, let's get into this beauty. So before I switched into this bag, I had been in my Rogue for two weeks. Yes, two weeks. I am starting to notice when I really think about the wearability of a bag versus just what my eye likes, I stay in those bags longer. And this bag is one of those. So I actually saw this bag um, last year. It came out around November, December on the Michael Kors website. And y'all, I watched this bag and watched this bag and watched this bag and it never went on sale. So in January, I did go ahead and bite the bullet and buy the bag. This is the Sienna large logo shoulder bag. Um, I did pay full retail for it, which was $2.98, but it is currently on sale. I want to say you can get it for 20% off on the Michael Kors website. So let me tell y'all, this bag reminds me so much of a Graceful um, by Louis Vuitton or perhaps a Delightful in how you carry it. Except for it has like the shape of the, has the shape of my um, <laughs> Graceful, but it has the zipper that reminds me of the Delightful. So it is an excellent, excellent carry. Now I have been in this bag for almost nine days. And so I normally show y'all the bag as soon as I go in, but with this bag, because I've been sick, y'all are actually getting a real deal on how I feel about the bag after wear and tear. So the bag carries excellent. Um, at first, I was a little concerned because this strap is not the thickest, but it worked out perfect. You see, it has that beautiful smile. This is in the color vanilla and acorn. I have my favorite puff, and y'all already know that side view, but the pleating on this bag is absolutely gorgeous. You see the pleating here has the gold Michael Kors um, hardware and you have the pleating on the other side. Now, I did add this charm to it, which you guys know, I normally don't do a lot of adornments on my bag, but I just thought it looked so pretty on this bag with the puff. So let's get into her. The other thing is I've been like, I don't wanna say curating a collection, um, I've been curating pieces, if that makes sense. I'll find a print or a style that I like, and I'm starting to collect those pieces. So when I want to move towards those pieces, I have several items to choose from. And I'll be showing you guys some more of that in a little bit. But let's get inside of her. Y'all know I got my handy dandy you know, teak planner there. Um, I have my Victoria's Secret wristlet with my keys on it um this one i'm not sure when it came out but i saw it and i got this one off of amazon i did not get this one from victoria's secret but i just have my keys on there and i got this cute little teddy bear um that i got from shein a long while ago and i just decided to add that on another thing i've been doing like i told you guys i've been kind of like getting all my pieces that are alike 
together. So I kind of got a theme with what I'm doing. So I don't feel the need to buy so much. Um, I'm always going to buy because I just love bags. But I am, I have become a little bit more conscious. Now, this is a new purchase, y'all. <laughs> y'all ready for these? So I'm getting ready to go on a vacation. And I wanted some new sunnies. Um, my favorite sunnies actually are from Michael Kors. I'll insert a picture here. This is me wearing them and I love them. But I wanted another look. I wanted to elevate my look just a little bit. So yes, y'all, I got these little cuties right here. These are some Gucci shades. And what I like about them is I don't like shades that are dark. And when you put them on, everything is dark. With these right here, you are able to see everything still so good. And I'll put a picture of me wearing those as well. So this is my new addition for the summer. My Michael Kors shade, I've had those, oh my God. I would say for at least 10 years, if not longer. So this is what she's looking like. I did put an organizer in her just because... Um, I don't like my stuff moving all around. Again, y'all know I'm on the go a lot. So I like to just reach in, get what I need and pull it out. So on the side over here, of course, my same crackers and my Altoids. Um, Here I have this little pouch that came in a three-piece pouch from Walmart. And it says, did not wake up like this. And I just thought it was nice because it's flat. It was gold. It matched. I have my contacts. I have some rewetting solution. Have some pills in here with allergy, Tylenol, and Motrin that I've been refilling frequently. Then I have my gas pills in here. And then I have some clear eyes for contact relief wearers right here. So this is a really nice pouch. It's very thin and nice. Also in here, I have this beautiful pouch that I did get from Amazon. Um, it is very nice. I think I got it in a couple of colors, but as you can tell, this is in the brown. And so it matches really well. But I do want to show you guys, although this has all of the contents I normally carry, I want to show you guys how much this carries. And again, this is linked in my Amazon store as well. So this is what she looks like. I added a Shein charm, but she does come with that little circle charm on the zipper pull this thing holds a lot so this is what she looks like when you open sorry for all the noise i have a t um my tic tacs i have my bathroom spray i have my in the stars hand cream y'all see that i have my mentos pure gum i have a hair tie I have my placards. I have an itemizer that has Baccarat Rouge 540 in it. And then back here, I have mask, Clorox wipes, wet ones, Summer's Eve wipes, Purell wipes, and shout wipes. So I kind of combine the pouch. I have some cuticle oil down there have my tongues and then I have some bobby pins. So I have everything you would actually need if you were out and you needed something related to hygiene. Um, I have a lot of times people will ask me like, why do you carry so much? Or, you know, you get that infamous Mary Poppins thing. Y'all, believe it or not, I am still going through a transition of not having kids at home. Um, I don't know how everybody else ha has done with that. A lot of people don't talk about it, but it is a huge transition. Um, even though, yes, my kids are older now, my baby just finished with his collegiate year last year. And so <clears throat> me learning how to pack a purse that's not a mommy purse has been hard. Um, I am learning, but I still have my husband. <laughs> and those of you that are married know what I'm talking about. When we pack our bags, 
um, we are not just packing for us. You're packing for your husband. You're packing for your kids. You're packing for people that might be around you. But I have noticed in the past year or so that I am getting better with packing just what I need, which is why y'all have seen I've been carrying smaller bags. All right, so that's all that was on that side. Inside of here, I have my Dollar Tree pouch. Um, I just have my work badge and my work keys in here. And then inside of here, you'll notice it has a zipper pocket back there. Um, I have my Amazon um, AirPods. These work really good. These are linked to my Amazon storefront as well. Because as you guys know, I did lose one of my AirPods. Um, I am thinking about getting the Fit Pros. Um, I really like those. And um, I'll tell y'all more about those later. But this is another pouch that I got from Shein. Inside of here, I just have extra cards. Also, inside of here, I just have gift cards in here and I have my business cards. This is just a book on the bag. And again, this is the Sienna Large Logo Shoulder Bag and she is so worth it. And the last thing in the bag is my iWalk charger. So inside of here, if you notice this organizer is a lot smaller than the bag, that is my preference. I don't like putting organizers in my bag. And when I close the bag, you can see the shape of the organizer. If you look at this, you see you can look at this bag. Um, and when I hold it up, you can't tell an organizer is in it. It doesn't take on a boxy shape. So that's why I like to do organizers that are smaller than the actual bag, okay? So inside of here, I'm just going to show you what I have. I have another In The Stars hand cream. I have my Vaseline all-purpose hand cream that I love. I have my EOS lip balm. I have... This is so old, y'all. I told you I've been going through my stuff and really downsizing. This is Victoria's Secret. This is the Beauty Rush, and it's flavored, and it says indulgence. Um, this is just really pretty. I love the sparkle that it puts on my lips. I think their lip gloss is a little sticky to me, but it's tolerable. Um, this is my Fenty Beauty. This is in the color Cake Shake. Very, very close to Fussy. Um, fussy is one of my favorites. Also inside of here, I have the matching wallet. Y'all, I love this size wallet. If you look, it fits in your hand so easily. This is a three-quarter zip. So on this side, it's just gusted it, which I love. Dunia Burke also has a wallet like this, and it is my favorite from them as well. Um, you have the Michael Kors on the um, zipper pull, and it is your standard setup. Let me make sure. You have four card slots on each side, and I have them double. You have that big slip pocket in the back. I always put my cash here. Um, I just have one bill in there. You have another spot here, four card slots on this side, and then you have a big pocket back here. And of course, you have your change in the middle. Um, I just love wallets because I just like having everything together. So this is the Jet Set Travel Large Three Quarter Zip. And the color again is vanilla and acorn. So I have that to match the bag. Also inside of here, I have this beautiful pouch that I got from Staples. I added a charm up there. Inside of here, I just have like pins and my check registers inside of there. I think this is going to be like a nice staple. I could have put this inside my wallet, but I do like having it separate now. I'm trying to get to the point where I have staple pieces and I just need to switch bags. 
staple pieces switch bags and i'm wondering if that's gonna help me like rotate my bags more um because i kind of got the same color scheme throughout i'm very neutral with my bags so a lot of my stuff will work and y'all this was that special gift to myself this is that mason francis kirk dijon um itemizer and inside of here i don't have the baccarat rouge i do have the a la rose and oh my god if you like a subtle rose smell because i'm not a huge rose wearer um i think it can be very strong but they did this very good now i will say the longevity of this one is not as good as some of the other ones um, but I have noticed as well that when you order or have any um, colognes that aren't the perfumes or the extracts, they don't last as long. So this is very nice. I love it. And it was a splurge to myself. Um, also inside of here in one of the pockets, I have my Touchland um, hand sanitizer. And then... Let's see, on this side, on the outside, I have my Chanel mirror. Your girl is getting better with utilizing mirrors instead of her cell phone. And on the inside, I just have my purse hook. Um, I've heard a lot lately people saying, oh, their bags are staged. My bags look like this all the time. Um, I am obsessively neat with everything I have and these are just some receipts UPS and some other places um my bags are not staged if y'all were to see me at any time anywhere my bags are gonna look like that that's just who I am um, my mind works like that even in my profession um that's just how I am so I will set this up but I do want to share some more stuff with you guys um, one of the things that I like about Michael Kors is that they wrap um, the wrap on their their bags and stuff when they send them are wonderful. The other part, in case nobody knows, this bow you can take it off and it just slides on so easily. You just kind of hold it right here. So you take your thumb, you hold it right there. And you put the top piece on and then you pull it around and then it's back the way that it was. I really like that. I try to keep some of them on hand. Um, so when I'm giving out gifts or things of that nature, I have them to give. So I wanted to share with you guys another thing. If you noticed in a lot of my videos, I've been talking about like getting pieces that are in the same family so this summer like i'm not searching for things if i need to go to a lunch a barbecue something formal i have everything i need already in the house with what i'm currently rocking right so with this i've been going to the michael kors site probably since like november december and i just type in the word vanilla and when the pieces pop up and I like them, I get them. So remember I told you, say for instance, I'm having on a nice little um, maxi dress or I want to wear a skirt. Bam, I have the shoes to match. So that's that. If I had on some shorts and I wanted to wear this set, I could just... I got these right here. And again, a lot of these items are still on the site. Now, I got these shoes um, last year in the black. And when I tell you they were my go-to, I'm getting ready to run to Walmart. I'm getting ready to go to Target. Or I just had on some shorts and I wanted to be cute for the day. These were my go-to so I could grab those. And then the last addition when it comes to the shoes is I am a sneaker wear. Um, and for instance, if I went on a cruise, because y'all know your girl loves the cruise, and I wanted my bag to match, um, but I wanted to wear sneakers because y'all know it's a lot of walking. I did get these. So I'm kind of in that stage now where... I don't want to shop all the time. Like, I'm always going to buy 
purses and bags and things of that nature. But I don't want to do it all the time. I love being able to go to my closet and have everything I need. Um, there was another piece that was on sale that I purchased. And it was this small crossbody. Um, I have not used it. Has a little slip pocket there. Has a car slot here. Um, it comes with a coin pouch. And it also has a little AirPod holder. So you guys, there you go. I really don't have an excuse that I need, I need, I need. Because technically, everything that I need for this bag, if I wanted to wear it, I could just set it up. So really, it's just a matter that I just love purses like all of you. And that's that. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Um, like I said before, I am just a lover of bags. I am, I don't want to say curating a collection um, because I don't know exactly if that's what it is or not. I'm just trying to get pieces that are similar, fit my aesthetic, and that I can kind of use all the time. Um, and I don't have to like, oh my God, I got to run out and get this. Or let me get online and order that. It's already here and already in my collection. And I am having a ball, a ball, just putting all this stuff together. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Leave some comments below so we can chit chat. And as always, remember, remember, remember. Be good to others, but be even better to yourself because we cannot pour from an empty cup. Bye-bye.